So uh, today we'll be seeing the workflow of the mobile app uh, created using the Mobicool mobile app builder for the WooCommerce uh, platform based web stores by Webcool. And this particular app builder creates a fully native iOS app for your web store with a better user experience, blended features and functionalities. And on the other hand, the customers can make use of your store uh, features uh, that do on the go on their mobile devices now. It is also available for the Android devices. We have already shown you the video for the Android end and today uh, we'll be checking out the overview of the iOS app itself. So uh, without further ado, let's hop on to the uh, mobile end and let me show you how it works on the iOS there. And before we proceed further, please do subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to receive the latest updates from our end. Apart from that, if you find this particular video helpful, then do kindly give it a thumbs up. So let's hop on to the uh, iOS end now and let's see how uh, the iOS app works. So uh, right now you can see that I'm on my iOS device and I've already installed the uh, Mobicool uh, mobile app builders uh, app here uh, that we've created using the same. Now let's open the app and let's see the uh, overview of the app itself. So let me tap on that. So here you can see the home screen being displayed and thereafter we are on the home page of the mobile application at the very top we have the uh, categories here as you can see on the top right hand corner we have the cart icon to the left of that we have the notification icon so all of the push notifications are visible here and the customers can tap on any one of them and according to the link that has been set for those uh, the customers would be redirected to the same now let's cancel out that you can also search the products here by tapping on the search icon and entering the name of the uh, product and according to that uh, you can see the search results are being uh, uh, populated and uh, you can choose that particular product uh, that you want to search within the store and then you'll be on the product page of the same let's tap back back now just below these categories we also have some more categories here uh, then we have the featured products as you can see here the featured products have been set up to view a complete list of featured products you can tap here on the view all featured products then we have the new product arrivals that are there within the store they have been listed here to see a complete list we can tap here on the view all new products as well then we have the sale products as you can see here uh, below that we have the popular products and uh, just in the last we have the popular categories being displayed now this is the home page of your uh, woocommerce uh, mobile application on the ios device itself and on the bottom left hand corner you have the home page then you have the category then you have the account and you have the more section wherein you can add the website or the external links uh, for different options there and according to that the customers are redirected to that particular uh, external link so for example here we have the my account at the very top so if i tap on that uh, uh, the external link for that uh, my account that has been set up by the admin in the configuration settings would be displayed to the customer itself and the same uh, goes for the shop page and the welcome page as well so if i go to the my account section you can see that uh, particular external link set by the admin is visible to the customer there so maybe due to the slow internet connectivity uh, it's uh, coming a bit late there so yes so that's the thing about the uh, link there and uh, now uh, after the account uh, we had the more section now uh, let's go to the category section so here you will find the complete list of categories uh, that are there within the store and you can uh, tap on any of them to find the particular products under those categories now the customers can easily place the orders using the mobile application so for example here we have the fusion backpack uh, I can tap on that to check the complete details of the Fusion backpack along with the images, the reviews and the description there. So to view the complete description, I can tap here on the view all description option that you can see here 
on the uh, bottom right hand corner so if i tap in that we can find the complete description of this uh, particular uh, product there now to buy this product quickly by directly going to the checkout you can tap on the buy now button that you can see on the bottom right hand corner otherwise you can add this to the cart first by tapping on the add to cart button and then proceeding to the checkout button here you can increase the quantity of the units by tapping on the plus icon and you can remove the quantity by tapping on the negative icon just under the quantity there you can also with the reviews or you can add the reviews by tapping on the add your review button and from here you can get the stars you can enter the message that you want to send and uh, for this particular review and uh, you can enter your name email and you can submit your review for the approval there now uh, let me go back let me go back once again so for example if i'm on the uh, backpack section here we can list the product uh, as in a list view or in a grid view so if i tap on the grid view it is a grid view right now i'll tap on the list it uh, displays the products in a list view on the sort uh, sorting we can sort by popularity average rating uh, we can sort by newness of the product we can sort the price by uh, low to high and high to low price so here you can see that it's right now uh, all combined there so if i go for high to low uh, let's sort it by high to low so the highest is 218 and the lowest is 83 in the last so that's how you can sort and change the uh, listing of the products there so now let's uh, make a purchase but for, before that uh, let's uh, log into the account so we will go to the account section and here uh, we can sign in with our email or the user uh, name we can also create an account if you want if we don't have an account we can create an account on the go to create an account just tap here on the create an account enter your username email password tap on the sign in button and your account gets created now to uh, sign in just tap here on the sign in enter your username your password and then type on the sign in button there and as soon as you have signed in now under the account you can see a logout button and here you have the customer information that has a dashboard order section address book account information and the downloadable products so under the dashboard you can find the completely uh, complete listing of the recent orders that you have placed you can check uh, the complete uh, orders that you have placed here from here you can view any of the order details can reorder or can write a review for the particular uh, product so if i tap here on the order details here are the order details of the complete uh, order that we had placed now let's go back then we have the address book here you can enter the address uh, uh where you want to get your products delivered so you can add multiple addresses as well uh, then at the last we have the reviews if you have given any reviews those would be listed here so this was about the uh, what we say as the dashboard section and uh, thereafter we have the orders section here you'll find the complete list of orders that you've already placed and can view the uh, details of the same then uh, you have the address book here you can edit any of the already edited uh, addresses and you can add a new address as well uh, as per your own requirement now let's go back then we have the account information under this particular section you can uh, change your password your first name last name or your email as well and then you can tap on this save account button to save the details there under the downloadable products you'll find the complete list of downloadable products that you purchased within the store here you have the option to download the uh, particular downloadable product with the order details or the product itself so this was about the account uh, section uh, we checked out the categories the complete categories are being listed here uh, we can tap on any of the uh, categories there and the respective products under that category would be displayed to the customer uh, very quickly and that too swiftly and the very first option that we had here was the home page now let's do one thing let's uh, purchase a product uh, so let's uh, purchase this brown bear notebook so I'll just open the product page and here I'll make the units as two. Here you can see that we have the reviews for this one as well. You can also view all of the product reviews before making a purchase. And now let's tap add to the cart button. This would add this particular product into the cart and then we can easily make a checkout thereafter uh, using our mobile devices. So it's being added into the cart 
all right the product is in the cart let's go to the cart by tapping on the cart icon from uh, within the cart you can apply a discount code if you have any to get some discounts otherwise we can directly uh, go ahead and tap on the proceed button in the last that brings up the shipping section where we have to choose our shipping method and then we'll tap on the proceed button lastly we'll choose the payment method and tap on the proceed button and uh, on the review and payment section we can check the details of the order uh, the quantity and the order total that needs to be paid and then we'll tap on the make payment button to make the payment there and this would also place the order and uh, thereafter the customer can also check the order details so the order has been placed and the order number is 1494 let's tap on the continue uh, shopping now let's go to the account section orders and here we'll find the order that we have just placed that's the order number 1494 at the very top if you want you can also reorder by tapping here on the reorder button and this will add the product again into the cart as you can see so that's how this particular uh, app works and on the iOS devices and uh, the home page you have seen the uh, different sections that are there the featured products new products and much more and we've gone through the categories how the categories can be waived we have the more section for the external links uh, it's um, more of like an android app as well but for the ios uh, uh, devices there and uh, yes that was uh, much there and uh that and that was much about the app itself so uh, that was uh, the order of the ios app itself and i hope it helped you out in understanding the flow of the app itself um, and uh, if you still have any questions queries suggestions or requirements then kindly do reach back to us at support at the rate of .com, raise a ticket at webcool.uvs.com apart from that if you find this particular video helpful then kindly do give it a thumbs up and lastly thanks for watching this video and have a great day ahead.